hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video we are going to talk about how we can create a bouncing ball animation using the rigid body simulation in blender so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial and here you can see guys we are going to make something like this in this video so make sure you watch this tutorial till end so now let's start it so all right guys here you can see we have a new project file and right now here you can see we have a one ball model and we have a one floor here so what we are going to do exactly we just uh, fall this ball down and it will bounce it so how we can do this so for that first of all i will just select my ball and then i will just go to my physics settings and here i will just select the rigid body sorry rigid body yeah or after that i will just keep this type as a active and we'll just go to our surface response option okay and here we'll just increase our bounciness value we can do 0 0.7 i think that's enough right now and after that we'll just select our floor and we'll also add the rigid body simulation into our floor as well but right now we'll just change the type as a passive we don't want to simulate this plane basically we want to interact this floor with our balls so that's why we choose as a type as a passive okay and after that we'll do same thing here as well we'll just decrease the friction to zero and we'll just increase the bounciness to all over one and one more thing we'll just do it we'll just select uh, our ball and we'll also increase the our uh, friction to one and now here you can see when i'm just gonna play the animation so it will look something like that here you can see when i'm just gonna play the animation so now here you can see guys we have a, a perfect bouncing ball animation and which is look nice by the way so that's how guys you can do a bouncing ball animation using the blender with the help of the rigid body simulation that's pretty easy and cool trick so i thought i should share with you you have to just do some settings and after that you have a good result here and here you can see we have a perfectly bouncing ball animation so i hope guys you learn something new today and uh, i hope you also enjoy this video so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button and the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have session please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply your comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys